Hi there, and welcome back to Stubbs Aquatics. In the fourth episode of uh, the pond rebuild, we're going to get the skimmer box in. We hope uh, to get the uh, waterfalls going, and definitely have to get the uh, filters going. It's going to be a bit of a rush. I don't know how much we're going to get done, and may even get a couple rocks down there. It's been a long process. Again, I want to thank all my friends and family for helping out. Well, it's hot out here. I need a beer and uh, we got to get going. Stay tuned and remember to hit that like button, think about subscribing, set that notification bell so you don't miss any, any upcoming videos. Let's get going. Skimmer box is in place. Just have to wait and let that seal all been siliconed. And then I can continue filling. Water's been running for another few hours. It's getting higher and higher. I'm liking it. Still got a little ways to go yet. That's my skimmer box. Starting to fill. Uh, let's see how high I can get this. I debated whether uh, to raise that uh, skimmer box a while back, but I think that's we're going to hit our major height uh, in another 3-4 inches. But we had room. Still do. We'll see what happens. Boy, I can't wait. Oh, we're almost filled. To the point where I'm going to stop and uh, move everything and get it all ready. Obviously that liner is going underneath the deck. Probably going to bring it up another inch, maybe two inches, and that's about it. Which will line up pretty good over here. Won't be perfect, but a lot better than it was. Oh my god, that was cold. Oh, cold, cold tap water. Well, I missed filming part of the uh, setting up of the waterfalls. It was too hot and shut off. But we, you get the idea. Anyways, we're going to keep working. We're just leveling off the back end of the upper little pond here. It's not much of a pond, it's only about a foot and a half deep. But it's going to hold some uh, filter plants in there. And our two uh, filter units will flow into it. That being a uh, easy pod and the other one being a Laguna filter falls. This should really uh, help with filtration. It's going to be easier to get at making our life uh, much easier for me and uh, that's what this builds all about other than uh, replacing the liner it's just making things easier and it's just going to be so much better with the uh, nexus or it should should say easy pod there be way easier to clean and just to get at it's the hard part about this is the uh, uneven ground and it's more shoveling so but luckily I had uh, lots of clay and stuff from out of the pond right there and ready so it's just me shoveling in uh, excess and making the bank a little stronger and sturdier I have to fill in uh, with lots of rocks underneath that spruce tree uh, just because that's where the old falls used to come down 
And now that it's not, it's just going to be, have to be covered in. It's not going to be a fun job, and it's going to be awkward to get to. And, but <laughs> if it wasn't hard, I wouldn't be doing it, right? Got to be a beer break in here soon, but not before we move the filters. This uh, Laguna Filter Falls has to be moved in order that I can uh, release my fish. And they've just been in this upper level way too long and overcrowded. Nothing good can come from that. Uh, so the quicker we can set up the uh, filtration, the quicker I can move these fish off. Really gonna have to do some really good cleaning on all these uh, filter pads. I remember, I had twice the fish load in this small pond than I ever did before. Far from being done, but you get the idea. That'll be twice the flow rate. Plus, I gotta seal up the water so it's not running behind the waterfalls. But you get a rough idea. And then it'll be flowing out this end. It's all gotta get prettied up. We've only got the one pump going now. Have to hook up another filter there. Double the filtration over on this side yet. And there won't be much of a flow out of this one. That's about it. I just have to clean that up and make it look nicer. So, a lot of it's just cosmetic now. Putting rocks all around. Lots of work to be done. This was prettied up a little bit. A little nicer looking. That rock was heavy. But, lots of more heavy rocks to move yet. And then, I got double that on the other side, at least. All good fun. I've replanted all my lilies. Hopefully, uh, they'll come up nicely. So it's all fresh soil and then clay placed on top uh, so if the koi get into it it's only beneficial clay that they're beginning into so it's kind of a win-win and the plants will stay intact man those uh, water lily were hard to move and very very heavy But they will be pretty this year. Skimmer went in pretty easily. What you're seeing on top of the water is just the uh, flower portion uh, that dropped from the uh, crab tree. That's what, that's what was holding the actual uh, uh, flower itself. And then in behind it will be the uh, small apples. I have to net all that out of the skimmer box. They call them stems stub. I still have a lot of bog plants. They'll go up above in the waterfall area. I made it deeper, uh, so it'll be better for the uh, bog plants itself over the winter time. We'll take a quick look at that. Now you have to remember, this is just at the rough stage. Uh, a lot of work to be done on this. I've got the Laguna Filter Falls. I'll be adding the uh, Easy Pod in behind there. And then in there, I'll have uh, a bunch of uh, bog plants. That's about a foot and a half deep. So plenty uh, depth. The flow that's coming out of there will be twice the flow that's uh, there right now. And uh, lots to be done back in here. In fact, there's lots to be done all over the place, but I think it'll be a lot better. Bet these guys can't wait to get moved. Just have to decide which ones are staying in here and which ones get to go to the big pond. I'm kind of leading to keeping most of my uh, 
Shiro Utsuri in here and maybe my one Kiyu Utsuri. And then the, everyone else can go down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on that. Well, this just about wraps up episode four of the Pond Rebuild. I'm just starting to get over how cold that water was. Oh, man. I definitely wouldn't want to enter any uh, underwear uh, modeling contest. That's for sure. Oh. Anyways, uh, on the next episode, I really hope to release uh, my uh, koi into the main pond. Still, we have a lot to do yet. Uh, next episode will pretty much be on the uh, cleaning things up and uh, placing rocks around. Uh, we still have a liner to cut yet. Still a lot to do. Uh, I want to thank everyone who's been tuning into these. I'm really glad that uh, you guys suggested uh, that I do a pond rebuild series. I hope you, uh, you have been enjoying it. Again, I don't mind uh, taking any uh, pointers or tips. I'm definitely not a pro, that's for sure. I want to thank my family and friends again for all their uh, great help. I just I, I couldn't imagine trying to get through it uh, without them. If you like what you saw, please uh, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Think about subscribing and please hit that like button. It really does help. Well, thanks everyone. Take care and hope to see you on the next uh, episode. Lots to do on that one. I think you'll like it. Take care. See you real soon.